Hello, I'm John Moore. I'm the Managing Director for the IoT Security Foundation. I'm joined here today with Jeff Day. Hello, Jeff. Hello. Jeff is the Chair for the Working Group on Connected Consumer Products. And I think we'll just start, Jeff, if we can, by looking at why we chose the Connected Consumer Product area as a priority for our, for our best practice guidelines. So could you tell us a bit more about the background too? Well, there's uh, a lot of new entrants um, in the industry who have come in to that particular niche. Uh, so in the Connected Consumer area, we are seeing many new designers and developers, companies who are creating some great products, some really interesting stuff. but they're coming in without a background uh, in the IT industry necessarily and uh, they aren't always addressing security in that area. That's good Jeff, so um, can I also ask who are they for specifically? Primarily they are for the designers and developers within a company because these are the people who are actually creating the product from nothing. So we want them to focus on the security for that product so that's where that starts. And what can they expect to gain from following the guidelines? What they will get is um, some clear information on how to design security into their product from day one. And then the benefits from that are the fact that the product that comes out at the end is safe and secure. And it also can help the company create their own kudos in the fact that they'll gain a reputation for building good, safe, secure products. Yes, I, I think this is absolutely key, Jeff. We've yeah. spoken about this many times before, that the, the fundamental concept of IoT and connectivity is we're all connected, so yes. we're all relying on everybody doing their part. Absolutely. It's all about developing trust all the way down through the supply chain. Um, so if you are buying a product from a particular brand, with that brand, hopefully, you are expecting to get a good quality product. Okay, so we've now identified the type of companies that should be interested, the types of people in those companies who should be interested. Yes. At what point should they start using the best practice guidelines? Oh, well, that's very clear. They should pick these up from day one. From the moment they sit down with a clean sheet of paper and a pen in their hand, that's when they need to start thinking about security. There is no point in trying to do it later down the production line or even to tack it on afterwards because that just becomes expensive and difficult. Do it from day one and build it in as a complete integral part of the product. So that's, that's really good, Jeff. What we've learned then is why we're doing it, who it's for. Is there anything else that you would like to add at this point? Well, the guide itself, if I can briefly explain, is um, a series of one-page documents uh, the whole series is all about securing your product, but each page covers a particular topic within that. And then within the page, there are a, a, a series of items that you should address. And if you address all of those items, then you will have covered yourself f against threats for most issues your product is ever going to come across. And then to complement the guide on the IoT Security Foundation website we have some supplementary material which is a series of articles that goes into greater detail about each of these topic areas so if as a designer perhaps you're not quite so familiar with one aspect you can go onto the website look up about that particular topic and get much more discussion and detail on what that issue is all about and that should help you in your design phase. That's great Jeff and can I just say thank you on behalf of our viewers too. One of the briefs that we gave the working group was that the security guidelines are consumable so they're easy to use. We know there's quite a lot of material out there but what we wanted to do was make it digestible very simply and Absolutely. I think you've done an excellent job. Thank you. No, so thank you. We would of course invite all our viewers who are providing connected consumer products into the IoT space to download and consult our guidelines. We've tried specifically to make them simple to use and consumable, and as Jeff has said, we look to cover off many of the issues that are common today. You can download the guidelines from our website. Thank you.